Hello and welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you how to install a desktop environment or GNOME to be specific in Arc Linux. So if you installed it without a desktop environment or you have used it for a long time, you want a desktop environment. Uh, it's relatively simple to do and all you have to do is first let's refresh our repository. So sudo Yo, so we'll upgrade the system now this is to make sure that everything is up to date and we are not using any older hardware sorry old software so this shouldn't take that long so depending on your update size just wait for it to finish and then we can move on to the next step also you can move on to the next step without updating but it's not that recommended you can do it but it's recommended to update your system. So there we go. Now everything is updated. Now just reboot your system. Now it has logged in. So now that it is logged in, we can move on to the next step. So first you need xorg and xorg server so what you have to do is type in sudo pacman and then xorg server and then just hit enter oh sorry <laughs> i accidentally forgot the most important thing there we go just make sure you don't mistype any commands there we go now it's asking which uh, packages we want we want all of them so it's fine and then there are repositories and uh, i'll just go with the default one should be fine then just hit yes we want to download it and just wait for it to finish it shouldn't take that long now keep in mind in arc uh, you will get mostly the base version of the uh, desktop environment so any desktop environment you install it will be the base version without any customization so now after uh, xorg is installed, you just have to type in sudo pacman dash s and then no, then hit enter. I just select everything default, then hit yes. So it will install everything that gnome needs and I just selected everything. You can pick and choose if you want, but I'll just get everything. So there we go. Uh, I think there are some packages that didn't get installed and as such, uh, uh, let me just uh, verify this. Yeah, uh, I'll just go with the second one. Okay, I think uh, the first server had some issues. So I'm just getting the rest of the thing from the second server and if you have this issue or if you see any failed uh, issues coming up just type the command again and see it in other servers if it's working or not uh, i think this should work yeah there we go so if you have any failed issues or any packages that do not get installed in the default uh, mirror then just uh, install it from the other one and you should be good to go so now there we go everything is done and all we have to do now since we are installing gnome uh, we have to install a display manager so we can do sudo pacman dash s gdm and this is basically a gnome display manager so it is a really small package so it is fine also, we should uh, verify that display manager is working mostly because uh, if that's not working, then we will have some issues. Now, if you see this uh, comma, this thing right here, then that means it's working. And now we just have to enable this display manager instead of instead of the default one. So we'll just say sudo system cdl enable. 
DM dot service. Now, as you can see, now we are in GNOME, and now we'll just log in. I'll just skip this. So there we go. And uh, also, if you are missing the uh, GNOME, what you got dog here? That's because again, I this is the bare bone GNOME, and I have a video on how to get that. So make sure you watch that to get your desktop. So now, since everything is working, let's just uh, check if we can install applications and such. So where is the time? So that's basically it. That's how you install GNOME in Arc Linux and I'll just give it a restart and see if everything is working. And there we go. So that's how you install a desktop environment in Arc Linux. If you find this video helpful, leave a like. And if you are new to the channel, subscribe. It helps out a ton. And stay tuned for more tutorials.